Hey, so today I have three machines I want to show which generate all six types of uh, silverfish blocks. So here are the six types. Two of them are cobblestone and stone, which you can make generators for, and the other four are the stone brick variants, which have to be placed by the player. So that machine over there will dispense stones to the player. Uh, you can see silverfish enter into these blocks and I've got a texture pack which just displays a little red dot on it to show that it's really there. Um, so the way you can detect these um, silverfish entering with redstone is through an observer. Pretty much every design I found on YouTube had like either one of two major flaws. One of the flaws was it would just break if the machine was unlucky and that, that obviously that's no good at all. Um, but the other flaw was that the um, every once in a while there would be a cobblestone block sent through the chain and a, a silverfish never entered into it but for a machine i'm working on i need a pure line of silverfish and i couldn't find one so basically what i'm doing in this machine is when a silverfish enters into this block it will send a, a pulse here for a t flip flop and that will push the silverfish up. And there is no way for, well, I just messed it up. But um, okay, but once the silverfish are up, there is no way for it to enter into this block. So uh, I am free to go ahead and push this next block. But I mean, of course it's off but this piston extends, which allows the signal from the hopper clock here to go through. It's the same basic principle in all of these things, but that's what allows this to be a pure stream of silverfish. I have this command block contraption over here, which is basically going to prove that. So you see there's one monster egg there and one cobblestone. So if any cobblestone goes through, um, the command block will detect it. So I'm gonna do a quick tick warp. And that silverfish is from before, it's actually not leaking. Okay, so I gotta go buy it. There's a spawner inside of here, and um, the spawner is the same thing that you would find in a stronghold. Uh, you can go ahead and remove the end portal or just leave it. And uh, I'll show, I'll do some tick warps at the end for a long period of time to show rates, but I mean, that, that's pretty good already. <laughs> So 62 in a row. And here is the stone version. So for this, I actually had to slow it down a little bit and add a dispenser. Um, this, otherwise without this, I'll be, let me just turn it on so I can talk about it. Um, once the, once the cobblestone gets pushed, we need to dispense the lava into the dispenser so that it will not um, fall down due to random ticks. So lava, let me show that real quick. If you set the random tick speed to um, a high value, lava will just flow immediately because liquids get random ticked. So because of the dispenser, um, this will ensure that no matter the random tick speed, it will never go and break this water right here, or just like break the whole thing in general. And for the final version, um, basically it relies on the player. The, all the other ones are fully automatic. This one relies on the player to be physically standing here. Um, and if the player was in survival mode, You can just stand here and hold the right mouse button down and wait for everything to go through. Speed it up a little bit. Um, yeah. Ideally, you would have nothing in your inventory, but it's a little screwed up just now.
And yep, yeah, obviously not once throughout this did I have a single piece of stone. So the cobblestone was just for my testing before. So I'm not going to bother with a tutorial for this. Um, I'm just going to go ahead and give a world download, but I'll quickly just move over and around these. These, these contraptions are pretty simple overall. Just the, the idea of moving the silverfish up was the, the trickiest part to implement. But yeah, there's really not that much going on here. Especially like this, this contraption. Like I have absolutely no idea why somebody would want like silverfish eggs in cracked cracked stone bricks, but I figured if somebody wanted it, like it's here and it was interesting to think about that one. So that's about it.